feeling good but yeah it's sunday i am going to an old church that i used to go to um so i used to go there a few years ago like before COVID, and then COVID happened and it took a really big toll on our pastor and he kind of went through just a really really hard time he ended up stepping away from the church and leaving which is so so sad i mean i know everything works for a reason and god is working in the midst of everything and maybe god was calling him to rest and you know to step away um and get his like soul and spirit in a better place but it was just super sad he was a really good man he is a really good man a really good leader a really good teacher of the word of god and so when he stepped away it was just such a weird time COVID was happening everything was just so weird and different we didn't really have a pastor for about a year or so so i ended up going back to my mom's church which is the church i grew up at and i love that church too but now that i moved it's a little bit further away and i always have had a desire to kind of have a local church be a part of a local church and a local community and so the old church that i used to go to where the pastor left is now like eight minutes away from me if even that it may be even not even that long so i went there last sunday and there's a new pastor they have a new building that they own which is super exciting and the word was really 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 good and so I was just like, I'm going to go back again this week and just keep praying that God gives me discernment and gives me, you know, gives me like confirmation on where he wants me to be. So, yeah. We gotta go. This is the outfit is it focusing can you see <laughs> um this jacket is from fashion nova it's super cute it literally um this unzips and you can wear it as a top and a skirt a full outfit which is so cute um i have on this black top this top is pumi it's an amazon brand that is very comparable to skims this little necklace i actually got from target these earrings are from amazon my jewelry is from oma the label i think that's how you say it it's a black owned jewelry brand they're actually sold in macy's now which is super cool these cargo pants are fashion nova and i just have on my sambas so yeah this is the outfit very casual I really struggle with my style in the spring. It's just such a hard time of year for me to put the fits together. And I just really have not been feeling like myself lately. I have not had my hair done in a long time. If you're a girl, you get it. There are just certain things that make you happy, make you feel like yourself. And I have a hair appointment tomorrow. I'm getting knotless braids and I'm so excited. Whenever I have braids, I feel like I'm at my peak black girlness. Like that is when I feel I'm not girl. <laughs> Guys, church was absolutely phenomenal. It was just really good. It was about how we're living in literally the loneliest generation ever. And God did not create us to do life alone. He created us for community. I was telling you guys about service <laughs> people start walking towards my car so I just put the camera down but service was really really good I just went grocery shopping I have my groceries and my cute little tote and now I'm at Starbucks I never come to Starbucks because um, there's no drive through Starbucks by where I live also the Starbucks downtown is horrible there's one in like campus marshes area if you're from the metro detroit area you know that that starbucks is absolute trash it is horrible 
so yeah but i just went to trader joe's which is near this drive through starbucks so i'm just stopping here i wanted to try the lavender matcha but they're out of stock here you guys i'm so happy that i went back to that church it was so good the message was just so good i just really had a good feeling there there were people around my age that i could see myself you know forming acquaintances and friendships um there were these two older ladies that <laughs> were really nice it just gave me a really 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 good feeling and today was baptismals i love baptisms i love baptisms i'm going to cry every single time anyone goes into that water it just be that like in the name of the father it like that for me <laughs> oh i'm gonna be bawling i'm gonna be bawling all the time i don't have to know you i'm gonna be bawling i think baptism is so beautiful just that public decor declaration it's just so beautiful and the guy that got baptized today kind of told his story and how he grew up atheist and it just really drove home the point for me like god is just so able no matter how you grew up no matter your circumstance and what you've done god is willing to welcome you in with open arms at any point in time he's just waiting for you to like answer the call and so it was just so beautiful and the guy's name was like Aten or a Tim, a Tim. It was like a really cute name. I was like, okay, what that cute name? What is you, Puerto Rican? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anytime I hear a cute name, it goes right onto my baby list. Do you guys have like names already saved? I know girls probably do, but yeah, I have a name list in my notes and i anytime i hear a pretty name i add it do you guys ever notice that a lot of starbucks at least here in michigan they have it where once you're in line you can't get out is that a marketing move that no matter how long the line is you can't leave the line so you're just gonna have to wait i always think about what if your car break down like that is so humiliating to be holding up the entire line and i would be the person who car just like shuts off <laughs> i always think about random stuff like that like what if my car just shut off like i would be so embarrassed what would you even do <laughs> totally forgot to end the vlog yesterday but today's monday i just got my hair done thank you guys so much for watching i'm gonna end the vlog here i will talk to you guys later hasta luego